Hey guys, I went and got this precision knife set. Uh, Gordon is the name brand. That's the same name brand as their nicer set. Um, lots of options, a lot of propaganda on the outside. Uh, item 36410. Thinking I paid about 10 to 15 dollars for this. I honestly don't remember. But let's see what it's got. It says 56 piece. I kept the cover and this insert. Uh, I've been using this for several months now. I bought this because I do a lot of work with these types of knives, with hobbies, and I wanted options. But uh, these, I've used this type of handle before, and in my opinion, they do not hold up over time. Uh, very cheap case, <laughs> very cheap knives. I will use these. And, and there is the weakness, is that it's plastic. This plastic insert breaks over time. When you think about it, you're typically doing small work and you're pressing kind of hard. And over time, that will break. Now, it'll take a while. But if they made that out of aluminum, they would last a lot longer. But they feel good in your hand. They're, uh, they feel just like an X-Acto knife. In that sense, they do okay. And I've got a scratch all, and it does come apart. And the way it's constructed is all metal, so that's probably going to last a little better. And I got it for this also because sometimes the smaller ones, if you use them for a long time, uh, irritate your hands. And you get cramps. Um, so this is a lot bigger, and this uses a very different thing. It, you loosen it at the bottom. Looks like that might last longer. Uh, when it only comes down this far is when they break. So this one's probably going to last a lot longer. And it is a different way. And I'm thinking they probably came up with this different way because of some copyright for Exacto. Very, very small handle. And it does this. And there, that being so short, I think, is why it breaks. I'm not saying it's going to break tomorrow, but it will break long before an exacto knife would. And here's a slightly smaller than the bigger one, and it uses the same short holder. And this bigger piece, uh, I, I use these. I use these occasionally, and they're kind of nice to use, um, and they work the same way. So I use this occasionally and it really helps if you're cutting something repetitively or or thick this is what you want it's less stress on your hands easier to keep easier to keep a hand on now you don't see these very often with the kit now I always keep one on hand maybe use dryer with thin oil I'd recommend thin oil these mostly use number 11s you have to be careful. It's kind of easy to cut yourself. Uh, and while you're using it, you can sharpen your razor blade while you're cutting. So if you, you're in a longer project, rather than switch blades, you can just sharpen it real quick. And that'll make your blades last longer, but the blades are still disposable. Okay, so the case is kind of nice. Seems like it holds together okay. Ooh, that magnet doesn't work very well. Now, I like the case. I really do. And it seems like this is an efficient way of doing it, but in reality, you're taking up a whole lot of the case for this. But it's so thin, you're probably not going to do anything else with it. Number There's three number 11s. That's what I use the most. These you use only occasionally. I hate to reserve all of this space for something I don't use very much. Uh, I keep about 100 number 11s on hand at any one time. So I'd like to have space for more of those, but I don't have space because this is so thin. So probably just leave it like it is. But it's a nice kit, very you know, a variety of handles. A 56 precision knife set. And it gives you an example of all of the blade types. There's the handles, the blades. I'm thinking they're telling you what size blade you should use with which handle. It's kind of good to have all these blades. You can experiment with what blade does what job best, and then you can restock certain blades. 
So I do a lot of hobbies that require things like this, so I invested in this. Uh, I like the case because it keeps things organized. So if you like the videos, please subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.